Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw the Among Us Sabotage button. So let's get started. To draw this cool button, let's first start by drawing a curve that's going to go up and over. So I'm going to start right here and I'm just going to kind of go straight a little bit. But I'm going to start to slightly curve up. So up and then I'm just going to go ahead and go all the way around. So this is the top of the head. And I'm just going to go all the way around, bring it down, all the way, and it's going to get wider. And as I come down here, I'm just going to aim to end in the same spot, same level as the other side. So say about right here. There. So you just want to create this big curve that's slightly slanted. And again, my camera, now it's level. From there, I'm going to come into this area where there's a slight curve towards the edge. I'm going to draw the visor. So just start with a curve and follow the angle and in. And then I'm going to start to curve it. Give a slight curve downwards. And same thing here. So this one's going to go up. We're just going to go all the way across. So because I have this um, starburst I need to draw in this area, I'm using a sharpie, I don't want to erase. I'm going to go ahead and do that first. But if you're using a pencil, just finish off your visor area. So I'll say about right, right here. I'll go ahead and start my starburst. So it's just a curve and a curve. And I'll bring this up. So nice and high, about right there. Bring it right back down and I'm just going to make sure this is at the same angle. So say about right here, give myself a point, bring it back down. And I just want to make sure this is at the same angle. So stop it about right here. And I'll just bring down my angles to connect to back to my point. There, so I've created that. And then I can go ahead and finish my visor. So just bring this out, pop it out, and about right here, round it off. Following the same angle, bring it in and connect. There, now I can go ahead and just thicken everything up. Okay, so I have my visor in finally. <laughs> Okay, so then from there, let's draw the pack. So I'll say about in this area, I'm gonna go ahead and pop out a curve, slight curve at an angle, and then I'll bring it all the way down. And let's see here. So I'll bring it down to about, to about right here, and then I'm going to go ahead and angle it in into this area to finish it off. And then let's give it some dimension. So right here, just give it a little angle. And then right here, and then we're going to connect downwards to finish it off. Actually, you know what? I messed up. So I should have come down here more and then finished it off. Okay, so I'll quickly come in here with my whiteout marker, whiteout pen, I mean. There, now it's all a mess, <laughs> but hopefully that helps. And since I have it out, I might as well do that part. Okay, so there. Okay, so then now that we have that in, and just when you're coloring, just add some of these highlights right here, the lighter, um, lighter color right here across. And then from there, I'm going to go ahead and draw the flames around it. So at the same level as this line where we start, I'm going to come out about right here, and I'm going to start with the flames. So I'll just go up. The first one down really close. So I'm just trying to follow the original. Come out, 
with one flame and then we're going to keep going all the way around and this one's going to come right back down to hit the head area and then we're going to come out with another one curve it up come out And then this one has a little zigzag part and we're going to come right back down to hit the pack. And then one more right here that comes up. Coming down. Try to look at the back of the jaw. Okay, and then up. And then one comes right in here. And last one, the small little one right here. And in. There. So we have the flames around this, um, this Among Us character here. And then now that this is all pretty even, right, we're going to go ahead and um, start the word sabotage. So right underneath this part right here, I'm going to draw the S. So it's in bubble letters. So I'm just going to go ahead and start with my curve and I'll quickly draw some bubble letters. So I'll just go ahead and S. Nice and tall, say about that much. If you're not comfortable drawing uh, bubble letters, you can always just write an S and just go around it and keep making it thicker and thicker. Okay, so I have my S. I'm going to come right across and in this area, right kind of like where the flame ends. I'm looking at my camera nice and even so about right here I'm going to go ahead and draw my E and down so bring this down so they're pretty thin so I'll bring this across about right here and draw my E Okay, so the reason I'm drawing the S and an E first is because in then I know where I'm going to end. So I don't uh, run into the trouble of where I keep going, keep going, and then it's too thin or too long, right? So now I know I just have to fit in all the A, B, O, T, A, G, E all in here. So I'll go back and forth, back and forth. So let's come right here. And I'm just going to draw the A. And so everything is nice and thin. Oops. And A right here, little line. And then the G right next to it. So I'll say about right here. And it's very forgiving, so <laughs> don't worry. As long as it looks like a G or E. <laughs> okay. My, my G. Now I'm going to go with my B. Right next to it. So B O. Okay, so I have four more I need to draw. About right here. So depending, your last letter might be really thin or really thick. So we are trying to make it as even as possible. A right here. Here, A, O, T, A. Okay, so say about right here. So I really hope this tip helps. Just go back and forth, and that way it's just a little bit easier to gauge. A, and then O and T. So now I have an O and a T, so. There, I just make my O a little thicker and then come in here with an inside oval and T. Yay, last one. Just fit it right in here. And your goal, of course, is just to try to make it about the same thickness all the way around for every letter. There, I have the word sabotage. <laughs> okay, so, um, it's basically all black, so I'll just come in here 
really quickly and just thicken everything. And I'm going to add a line here to finish that up. And okay, so I'll just go ahead and thicken everything up. So the point is so that there's no gaps and then you can go ahead and color that all in the top. See now there's no gaps, right? <laughs> So they're all done. I really hope I helped you draw the sabotage button from Among Us and that I made it fun and easy for you to follow along with me. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Drastic Kit videos. See you later.